Hello everyone and hello there YouTube. This is once again Mia and I'm back to give you the latest news and updates on blockchain today. Now for this video guys, we'll give you another article featured on today's issue of our newsletter at preferredcurrency.news. But before we go there, I would just like to invite you all to join us with this new Initiative Q program here. Now, Initiative Q is an attempt by XPayPal guys to create a new payment system instead of the existing old credit card system that was designed way back in the 1950s. Now, the system uses its own currency called the Q and to get people to start using the system once it's ready, they are allocating Qs for free to people like you who sign up now. Now, the amount drops later as more and more people join, so it's better for you to join now while it's free and it's still early. Now, signing up to Initiative Q is completely free and they only ask for your name and an email address. There's nothing to lose. But if this payment system becomes a world-leading payment method, your queues can be worth a lot. So guys, if you missed getting Bitcoin 7 years ago, you would not want to miss this one. Now here is your special limited invite link in our description below. Now the link shown will stop working once we are out of free invites. So guys, um, click it now and don't get left behind on this one. There. Now, moving forward, let's go to um, the article about the Kobo Hold Hardware Wallet will outlive you. Now, the arms, uh, the arms race between hardware wallet manufacturers is showing no signs of abating. Every new device must be more secure, robust, and impregnable than its predecessor to claim the bragging rights and earn the shekels of the crypto rich to whom nothing but the best will do. The Cobo Vault is the latest hardware wallet clamoring to be the best device of its kind. In a post-apocalyptic society many years from now, the year is 2140 and the last Bitcoin has just been mined. Thanks to the nuclear war, the population has been reduced to a few hundred thousand hardy souls. Bitcoin is the world's global uh, research or reserve currency, only there isn't much world left to fight over. Just some scorched earth, cockroaches, and a handful of gunmetal gray objects jutting willfully from the soil. These are Cobo Vaults the last surviving hardware wallets in the galaxy. What's in the box? What's in the box there? There's a wallet, charger, hard case, mine monic tablet, letters, screwdriver, charging cable, and some instructions there. Now, hyperbole aside, it's too early to tell how the cob of vault will fare in the long longevity stakes what can be said in the in the here and now is that this is the largest and heaviest hardware wallet you are likely to own the vault has many properties but portability isn't one unlike say the cool wallet the cobo vault is not designed to leave your strong room or bank vault which is a tougher ask than it might sound, because the Volt is the sort of device you want to show to all your friends. Do not be seduced by the sleek metal casing and sed seductively heavy touchscreen imploring you to Instagram this wallet. Those atheists are for you and you alone to admire. Good OPSEC is mindset, not a device. The Cobo Vault is both water and poppy proof. There. Features and benefits. If you're um, confident that you can resist the urge to should or to shout your ownership of the Cobo Vault from the rooftops, here's what you can expect from the $299 device, which will retail for uh, 479. Uh, dollars once full production starts. Now, it is air-gapped with no Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, and FC or USB capabilities. 
encryption chip with tailored firmware that meets BIP32, 39, and 44. Supports BTC, Ethereum, Bitcoin Cash, Dash, Litecoin, uh, ETC, uh, TRX, and EOS Plus, ETH, TRX, and EOS tokens. Military grade outer casing. Built in self destruct mechanism to protect private keys. Multi signature capability. Multi coin and tokens with no storage or memory limit for coins. No physical points of attack. Water resistant aerospace metal body. Magnetically detachable battery to avoid corrosion. The Kobo website is replete with video footage of a vault being plunged into the water and presumably living to tell the tale. Its protection case can also support the weight of a tank, where, so we're told. I wasn't brave enough to test my review device in such a manner as it wasn't manufactured to final spec. But like the Kobo vault, perhaps you're made of sterner stuff. The vault is beautifully packaged there now hands on with a Kobo vault the vault is beautifully packaged with build quality design and presentation that almost rivals ledger the experts are delivering immaculately packaged wallets this is the sort of HW that unboxing videos were made for a small instruction card guides users through setup in between delivering stern warnings such as the security chip will self-destruct if tampered with because the Kobo Vault app has yet to be made available on the Google Play Store I had to install it using the link provided prompting all kinds of scary warnings from Android There. Now production versions will direct users to the Play or App Stores emulating this hard Hastening step. After installing the app, you'll need to power up the Cobo Vault, which means removing the battery compartment and charging it using the separate dock. After powering up the vault, you're directed to a page on the Cobo website to scan in the QR code and verify the device. Then, after opting to create a new vault using the touchscreen device, it's time to note down your Mnemonic, heeding the on-screen warning to watch out for spying eyes or hidden cameras. Entering the 24-word seed is confusing as it is unclear that you're meant to hit return after typing each word. There are still some elements of the Kobo Vault that could benefit from refinement, starting with mnemonic confirmation. There. Pairing devices. Once the seed has been recorded, it's time for some more QR code scanning, this time to pair the Kobo Vault with the mobile app. When that's been completed, the mobile app shows a perfunctionary wallet screen. BTC and ETH are the only coins supported in the test version. But the full version will ship with support for all of the coins listed earlier, including BCH and Dash. The, vo uh, the Kobo Vault mobile wallet. Here. Now, a feature which now comes as standard on many HWs, the Vault included, is the ability to create a hidden vault. If the owner is forced to unlock their wallet under uh, duress, they can reveal an address containing only a nominal amount of cryptocurrency. An unlimited number of hidden vaults can be created with a Kobo vault, making it impossible for a physical attacker to tell for certain whether they're being shown the real wallet. To verify that everything's working correctly, I send a test BTC transaction to the vault and then send it on to a different address using the vault to sign the transaction using a QR code scan. Physical assembly. With most hardware wallets, the review ends once the mobile wallet and device have been paired. Bitcoin address created and test transaction sent. 
But with the Kobo Volt, the real fun begins when you prepare to pack the device away. The body and battery are separated and slid into separate compartments in the protective case. The case holds the entombed section snug without so much as a rattle no matter how vigorously you shake the ensemble. Yeah. One accessory that's yet to be covered in this review is the mnemonic tablet and letter block that enables you to encase your 24-word seed in a metal holder that looks as robust as the protective case for the vault itself. It would be nice if there was a means to easily separate the two halves of the tablet so that the seed could be stored in two separate locations. If you do decide to affix the letters into the tablet using the screwdriver and 282 letters provided, go ahead, but it might be wise to obfuscate one or more of the words. It might be wiser still to store your mnemonic tablet in a different location to your Cabo Vault. Now, the Cabo Vault is a solid piece of kit that's likely to claim the mantle of toughest in class at least within the sens sensibly priced wallet category. A few hundred bucks seems a reasonable outlay for a device that should provided proper OPSEC is used. Keep your cryptocurrency safe until time indefinite, or until you need to liquidate it at least. The software could and will be better in places, and the UX needs tidied up. Expect the sniggles to have been resolved when the production version begins to ship. The Kobo Vault will outlive you. The sooner you come to terms with that, the sooner you accept your own mortality and the immortality of Bitcoin. All right, guys, so that's what it, uh, that was it for the second article about the Kobo Vault hardware. Now, guys, what can you say about this one? Share with us your opinions on our comment section below. And of course, guys, you can always or you can also have your own copy of this article directly sent to your email by subscribing to our website or to our newsletter rather simply by going to the website preferredcurrency.news now here once you're in the website all you just have to do is go down and click on the link paypal where you can pay 15 us dollars per month on a recurring basis or you can also pay at Coinbase for only $180 per year with your favorite crypto handled by Coinbase. And after you do that, you start to receive our newsletter 12 hours ahead of our broadcast here on YouTube. There. Now, here is our newsletter. Now, this is the current issue for the day November 20, which included the different articles featured for the day. And we also have websites here that you guys should look into. Now let's go to the first website here, which is eosauthority.com slash alerts. Now, it is a great website where you can get alerts about transactions on your EOS account, such as incoming or outgoing transfers, changes or additions to the keys, airdrop sent to the account, actions authorized by the account or any ECAF arbitration notices. Also, EOS Authority performs as a block producer where it deals professionally with technical matters or issues of arbitration and governance. Again, guys, if you want to get notified regarding transactions on your EOS account, simply go to the website eosauthority.com slash alerts and just type in your account name and email address on the spaces provided for you here now here also to get the latest eos marketplace news from the experts you can subscribe by going to the website preferredcurrency.news and then you can advertise what you have for sale in exchange for eos and also what you would like to buy at our websites as follows now here in your Chrome browser, you can go to eosmarketplace.news to add your listings. Also, you can go to pcn.today for the latest news on blockchain. And also go to marketplace.pcn.today to place your additional listings. Also, 
you can go to preferredcurrency.news if you wish to become a web subscriber and our web subscribers can also go to twitter.com slash preferredcrypto now to get started you can sign up at pro.coinbase.com to change some us dollars into bitcoin so that you can then transfer that bitcoin to the binance exchange or to the website binance.com where you can change your bitcoin into eos if you wish and then you can download the free eos things wallet from google play store or your favorite app store so that you can use eos most easily now here um here is a good place to advertise whatever you have for sale or for rent in exchange for eos tokens and you can also click here to see how to get free tokens for holders of eos just be sure to click and explore all the links in each issue of this newsletter and here guys one important announcement to you all so please contact the publisher Donald the Guru if you have not transferred all of your EOS off the exchange just yet. You need to have your EOS in an actual wallet where you control the private key in order to get the latest newest free airdrops coming soon. Now, the newer airdrops will not be based on the original Genesis snapshot and the easiest mobile wallet is currently EOS Links. You can contact Donald by phone at 1-801-601-8105 or on WhatsApp at 1-801-471-6939 if you need help with this. And now here. Now, this is one great thing once you subscribe to our newsletter is that you get to see Donald's research list as to what he thinks are the most important coins or tokens are to be researched today based on fundamentals. Now, these are the ones that he thinks and is most definitely researching today and also invites you to do the same if you'd like to. So now let's go and take a look at this one. Now here guys, this is Donald's analysis for the day November 20. Now here on column A are the names of the coins or tokens. Now take note that the red ones have negative news, orange or tan are neutral, yellow are fair, green have good news, and blue shows the best news. On column B is the US dollar resin price. On column C, share of total market volume. On column D, Google searches compared to past 7 days. On column E, 50 candle SMA movement. On column F, number of positive technical indicators. On column G, 24 hours current volume versus price. On column H, 7 days weekly volume versus price. On column I, 30 days monthly volume versus price. And here on column J, is the percent issued. Now take note that this sheet is not a recommendation for you to buy or sell crypto. But guys, if you decide that you would like some, always consider offering about 20% below the current market price whenever you place buy limit orders. And of course guys, you can also have your own copy of Donald's research list simply by clicking the word file here on the upper left corner. Click make a copy. Now you can rename the document if you want to. Then after that click OK. So that you can have your own version which you can modify as you wish for your own purposes and research. You can also add columns, personal notes, and information to your own file copy there. Now also here guys, we have a great program to you all crypto lovers out there where you can become an affiliate for preferredcurrency.news and earn your crypto each month. Now you can invest your time in our affiliate program where you can earn affiliate commissions for seven levels deep. But here, um, you should not post your affiliate link in public forums or comments, but do it as private messages only after you chat with a friend or owner of another channel or account. Now enrolling as an affiliate is very easy. All you have to do is click on the image here on your copy of the newsletter or you can go to the website preferredcurrency.news and click on the affiliate tab on the upper right corner, enroll to your first blog and there you can earn your crypto. It's very easy and um, if you have other questions, 
you can always contact the publisher because he really wants to connect with you personally. Now, you can contact Donald the Guru through the following. Phone number at 1-801-601-8105. WhatsApp at 1-801-471-6939. Telegram at preferredcurrency.news. And our subscribers can also follow him on Twitter at preferredcrypto. There. Also here, for training on how to use your Preferred Currency Spreadsheet, you can click here for our YouTube channel which is called Preferred Currency News and subscribers can follow us on our private subscribers Twitter at Preferred Crypto for alerts and updates between issues. You can also email us to let us know your Twitter so we know how to approve you. And uh, we invite other YouTube channels out there to freely review and analyze our data. We hope that you embrace our affiliate program there. Now, all of the information provided in this video is for your news review and educational entertainment only, not uh, regard, uh, not as advices because here we are not financial advisors and we highly recommend that you do your own research on all the information we provided for you to make decisions for yourself now this channel and the website preferredcurrency.news is simply a gathering of the rumors and research available online each day all right guys so that was it for this video thank you so much for watching and if you like this one give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more updates. This is once again Mia, your daily broadcaster, signing off. And I'll see you later for more videos. Bye, guys.